Hi everyone and welcome to today's video. I've not done many bonus spies for a while and given the good run that I'm uh, currently on, uh, which makes a blooming nice change, uh, it's only taken about a year and a half to get on a good run, um, I'm going to do a few today. They, they'll be mainly the ones that you wouldn't normally see in play, so pretty much going to be the uh, the max, uh, you know, the all bells and whistles ones. There we go. Right, I'm going to start with mental. Um, dear, oh dear. I need another swig of uh, something strong. Uh, right, here we go. So, I'm going to buy the all bells and whistles one on mental. Right, so here we go. Uh, just going through the list here. Obviously, not going to spend 600. Reducing it down to 200, and that'll be the uh, mental free spins. Can be quite exciting this one. So here we go. Let's see what we can get. Well, not going to be much there. We could do it for patient or two showing up. There we go. Van Gerwen's on times 30 now. And there he is. Right, and we could connect here. Can we get a wild? Oh, didn't connect Van Gerwen. Good grief. Just need a bit of luck there, don't you? Yeah, where was that skeleton wild last time? Yeah, that, that's not going to be much. Didn't connect the, uh, the person, did it? It's not worth staying up for. Any patience there? No, it didn't connect. And again, needed the split in order to get the wild. Never did it. Can we get him this time? Oh, it's done it in the wrong place. Needed the skull on the second reel. Right, that has connected times 30, double ways. Get any more pleasantries here? Yeah, I've got the wilds as well. So that's going to be pretty good. I don't think it's going to be an out of this world one, but with these games you never know. Obviously doing count-ups at peripheral levels, given the stake. Anyway, it's flying up there. Oh, and it's stopped. Ah, uh, Sir Kenneth. We've got Sir Kenneth there. Yeah, that might be good. Oh, we connected Sir Kenneth again. But uh, that would be a decent round, that. Interesting to see exactly what that pays in comparison to the uh, to the earlier one yeah 10 come on keep going okay that's decent oh wow 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 that's brilliant that's way more than I was expecting off the kind of carry on winning brilliant stuff well it did cost me 200 for the bonus this looks like a dead spin at the end, so absolutely chuffed there. I would have been happy if that uh, last penultimate spin had paid sort of 75 80 was what I was expecting, so that was an absolute corker. Going to move on to this evil goblins now. Obviously, uh, bonus buy, I'm not really doing presses for luck today. I quite like this one because it gives you these booms and uh, it normally gives you a few pennies back so you know you're not getting 12 dead spins in a row so it's normally quite uh, quite kind but let's uh, let's get this loaded up just to get it on a suitable stake would help uh, yes okay well we obviously understand that Anyway, splashing the boat out a bit here with this 260 
six, but I want to try and get a bit of uh, excitement going today if we can. As I say, I have had a good run of late. So there we go, double kaboom, sir. Yeah, I've seen Dossies at low levels to see a uh, stake. Normally be much for superlative that. Anyway, another double kaboom. Times five there. Uh, yeah, I've got triple skulls there. That's it's rare that it does triple skulls. I'm not sure if we really get much benefit out of that though. Alright, another kaboom's dropped in. Tech never does triple skulls, it's doing them every go now. I just thought it did something magical when they turned up, but uh Oh god, two pounds only. Grief. It's one of the, uh, the starry eyes, the flashing eyes at the moment. You need three of them for a, a decent payout. I think that's where, where I've been going wrong on it. Wow, triple kabooms. I could grid there now. Can we utilise it? Oh, good grief, that's it. That's so frustrating, that previous go. Brilliant ways there. Oh, yeah. Just connecting. I fear the end is nigh, though. The end is indeed nigh. Goodness me, that was a stinker. That, um... 260... Six was the blooming cost of that, so that's a real dent, that one. Right, the border. So, I won't be paying 700 though. Let's reduce that down to a more realistic level. I think 365 is a bit too much, so... 182, I think, seems reasonable there. I'll stick with the uh, 182. So there it is, Coyote Spin, 16 of them as well. Obviously get your multiplier going on the right-hand side, so you get interesting very quickly. Times five. Really got to get more way so than that. And we've got the split there. That could be decent. Oh no, it's uh, different characters. My monocle deceives me there. So, uh, £80. That's a decent round. I must admit, I wasn't expecting it to be quite as much as uh, that, so that's a pleasant surprise. Loads of splits there. Oh, it's times ten now. Oh, 
Oh, this is absolute peanuts. How do you expect the big wins? You never get them. And when you do expect them, they're, they're absolute crumbs. Oh, there was the flag as well. Missed the blooming flag. That's the Holy Grail getting the flag at this multiplier. Well, that's it. That's going to be cracking, surely. You're kidding me. That was ten pounds for about two thousand of those red birds. It paid two pounds. Ten pounds. Oh, I don't know. That, that's absolutely baffling. Anyway, there we go. One hundred and twenty-nine. 35 so a slight loss overall on that one so next up big dogs this is obviously the, the double letter completion which you don't get too often in play and the beauty of buying this one is you often get a uh, you often get a few pennies back just while it sort of builds up the bonus and does the respins so Anyway, here it is landing, so that's what I mean, you immediately have got back 30 odd pounds on the buy. Yeah, it doesn't give you the multiplier there, anyway, so 10 spins, here we go. Okay, that's one door. Complete the grid on this section. That's where the uh, the fun prizes are. Anyway, that's a good door. Getting one in the centre. Not going to connect to the left, though, are we here? We'll be stranded. You need that big door, or the super big door, right in the middle, really, in order to. Uh, to get the maximum potential out of this. Oh, come on. The multiplier here. It's wasting rounds. Never really connects too much when you uh, get these. Come on, let's just get one more door. Yeah, okay, good. Oh, I'll settle for that. So, one round, it's all about this last go, isn't it? Can we get one more? No, it's been mean, so that's a shame that uh, it's rare to get the super dog uh, there. So, and obviously didn't oblige this time round. Just a reminder that there's £2,100 up for grabs on gentlemangambler.com. So, there's two £1,000 casino prize draws and there's a hundred pounds for uh, existing players who have signed up to uh, any of my links previously so if you were intending to play anyway and you'd like to get your name in the hat please do have a wander over to gentlemangambler.com fire in the hole two is the next one i'm going to buy africa grief two thousand 800? Well, even 720 is, uh, it's pretty ludicrous, isn't it? I might have done that one if it uh, allowed me a 10 pence go, but uh, I'm not spending 700 on it. Okay, straight on to 14x. I guess you're getting him double flowers and double multipliers. Look at that grid though. Ones are mandatory. Yeah, extra dynamite. That's helpful. It unlocks the uh, 
the tavern at the bottom. Yeah, it's just adding slowly there, and we're filling up rather too much of the grid. Another load of mandatory ones up top. Yeah, I need the Colonel to do something here, really. Oh, this is lame. We've used up so much of the grid already. Right, it needs to land here. Yeah, 50x, okay, that's a better one. It's going to be dynamite or bust though, isn't it, really? It's running out of room. Yeah, up to 63 there, 155x. So... Oh, come on. Oh, why can't it do one of those exciting beer trolleys? Well, last knockings, potentially. You need to land here. Yes, it did. Just made it. So... Right, again, down to last knockings. Well, 238x that has paid, which is obviously uh, nowhere near what I paid for it. So, another loss on this. I can see why I haven't done bonus buys much for a while, but uh, it is good to at least get some uh, different bonuses to show, that's for sure. Brew Brothers is the next one today. So, let's see how much that... So, Gold Betty, 600, let's reduce that down. So, here we go, 240. So, the Old Betty, presumably, now turns into Gold Betty. Yep, there it is. Come on, <laughs> we need some wilds off these. Okay, at least one of them has activated. It can't hang about here, otherwise get expensive a bit, uh, a bit quickly, really. Oh, I'm sure it can land normal wilds if it wanted to anyway. Yeah, like that, so it can land them. Just not being kind anyway. Ugh, double Betty's, but double ones. You get a super prize on this if you complete the whole grid, the whole of the uh, centre bits. I think it is with the uh, with the wilds. Not that there's much uh, danger of that on this go though. Right, well, this is ghastly fair. Yeah, I mean, it's one round to go. And yeah, they haven't even bothered. So that's quite a poor bonus, that one. It's normally a bit more reliable. So I think I'm going to try one more on this game. It's normally a lot more fun than that. So, here we go. Let's see if Betty can oblige on this occasion. Uh, 
And yet again, a terrible start. No wilds, and we're finally off there. Not on the other one. Well, this is going to need to go some. I mean, the normal bonus is better than this. This is awful. Three, but all the damage has been done. I'll scatter them about a bit, it'll be useful. Not really that many combos either. Didn't connect the other one and really get particularly far there. That was an awful bonus as well on this game. That's such a shame. It's normally quite a reliable game, this one, but not today. Next up, the hand of Midas. So, here we go, five scatters obviously on this one. Okay, let's hope we get a whole load of threes here, just one avoidance. Twenty-one spins. Well, can we get enough wilds to do this justice? Yeah, this is it's always the danger, isn't it? Okay, I've got one finally. Is it that much better than a normal bonus? This. Oh, this is ludicrous. I feel I've been duped on this particular game. This doesn't feel like a fair bonus buy to me. Well, can we make it to ten pounds? Spent a blooming fortune today at this rate. I cannot believe. Oh, go okay, made it to ten pounds. I can't believe it's not given more than one wild. That says to me it's absolutely pointless buying it. Might as well just get your normal bonus. Well, there we go. It's damage has been done, sadly. Let me get out of this pickle. There we go. I mean, that's not on. I don't mind buying games, but we feel like you're getting duped on the bonus buys, uh, yeah, that's not for me. That's very poor. I'm going to try Misery Mining now. So, let's go for the 800 one, but let's reduce that down to a more realistic level. So, here we go, going to go the rat mode. Wow, super high risk. Could get exciting though. Do you get the occasional characters turning up as well? Yeah, made it in there. Dynamite, that's what you want, Apple Dynamite. Okay, that's good. That's unlocked a few bits and bobs there. I'm 
90x, yeah, 25 all round. Well, this is a uh, decent fare, this. 425x and counting. We've got the 25s there as well. Well, this is uh, suddenly turning into a splendid bonus, this one. Oh, we must connect them on the next go. Got to connect here. Oh, it's missed the blooming lot, but uh, 1440 X there, though that was an absolute belter. That one just needed to be connect one more, though, to send it into uh, into orbit. There, 288 in total. Really did need that connector there. I must admit, I thought to uh, miscalculated the X of that slightly. Uh, there, it's getting a little bit carried away, but. Uh, it's still a profitable one, but <laughs> it wasn't quite the profit I was expecting it to stop at. But there we go. Uh, right, let's uh, let's go to uh, Sugar Rush uh, 2000 or whatever it is. So, £200 to buy here. And 10 free spins, here we go. Obviously, start the grid with two X's everywhere. Uh, let's need to get its act together. Get a grief. You'd think it had already paid out with all the two X's. Oh, I couldn't get the re-trigger. Just like any of these games, it's re-trigger or bust, really. Well, a nice, but that's more like a nasty, isn't it? No, and that's your lot, so very disappointing one there. I think I'm going to buy another one of these to see if I can... Uh, Get it to do it a bit more justice, really. So, just 10. If it's feeling kind, it can uh, obviously give you more scatters than uh, just the three. Okay, I need to collect the pink balloons here. Ah, oh, one short. A couple of wins only, not a good grid though. This oh, that's useless as well. Oh, this is ghastly. Where do all the big wins come from on this game? I mean, it's just. Seems like it's one in a thousand that pays out. I give it one more go at the lower, lower stake and see if I get any further with it. But I'm not holding out much hope. And this is why I haven't bonus bought for a while. It just can get too expensive too quickly at times if you don't get the luck. If you do, they can be brilliant. Yeah, it's a lot of stuff there. Okay, again, you kind of need a feel you need a re-trigger. Oh, it's a sen, but uh, only by proportion of the stake. Yeah, okay, well, this is at least getting a few grid positions, and that's amazing how it dumped so many of those in. So, another sen, a better grid. I mean, if this had been on the higher stake, it would have potentially been a really good setup. 
Yeah, another sen. Sen seems to be mandatory here. Yeah, that's good as well. God, it's a cracking grid. You just need a bit of luck at this point. You get a re-trigger on the last go. This, uh, this could get very exciting indeed. God, look at the your multipliers there. Oh, I needed the sugar bean there on that one. But another 47. Two to go. Yes, connected. So, about after 176, we get the, um, the hearts there. I don't see much on the horizon here, though. Wow, says, if only it had done this, sort of bought a higher stake. We've got one go left. This grid, I mean, any half decent win is going to blow this absolutely out of the water. Oh, yes, re triggered it. Re triggered it. Wow, says, I did not even account for that. Oh, just don't dead spin it. That'll do, that'll do. We'll get the purples here. This has got to be close to the 1000x uh, multiplier. I can't quite see the third reel. It might be on 1000x. 229. It is as well. It is. Oh, my word. How much did that one just pay? It's got a... Oh, goodness me. 225. 60 there. I still got a whole load of spins left. Oh, good grief, another re trigger would have been good. Oh, there's loads going on there. Oh, it's a bag of sand, folks. And this was a cheapy stake. Well, I said it was paid out one in a thousand on uh, Sugar Rush. I've hit that one thousand. Good grief. What a grid. Come on, just find any half oh, decent one. Only needs to be a win on real two or three, and uh, I think a three pounds twelve. Oh, nearly retriggered it again. Yeah, we're back in, back in. Wow, sis. Well, I said it was one of my challenges to get to the one thousand uh, multiplier, but I've done better than that. I've got it to one thousand. Pounds. Let's just uh, see that. Twelve hundred and thirty pounds and forty pence. Absolutely chuffed to bits with that because up until that point it had been quite an expensive day. And there we go. If I hadn't taken the safe option uh, and played it on sixty, uh, you could have kind of trebled that. But uh, you know that, that'd be uh, really miserly if I grouch. At that absolutely delighted to have got out of a pickle there today but that is the risk with bonus buys I wasn't enjoying it much up until that point and you always feel like you are chasing but once you get ahead of the eight ball and uh, you get into profit shire with a re-trigger like I had there then that's when the excitement can really take off I hope you enjoyed that one folks uh, I'm off for a hot toddy. My voice has been uh, suffering a little bit um, today uh, here. I've been a bit, a bit under the weather, but I uh, fight on. And uh, a hot toddy uh, rather than a champagne will go down a treat, uh, nodding at the butler in the distance. Thanks for watching, folks. Uh, I might do another bonus hunt, a bonus buy video next time if I'm feeling brave. But I just want to get over this one first. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.